And I got the, the tape one day before it was erased. Huh. So thank God, you know, because there's, there's, it's amazing that the, the, the troopers shot themselves shooting people. You know, I'm always amazed when people do stuff like that. It's like Abu Ghraib, you know, taking pictures of themselves, torturing people. You know, here, if you look really close, I mean, it's really grainy and terrible, but you can actually see people shooting people. And I'm amazed that they would shoot videotape of themselves doing that. I guess they, they thought they were doing a good job, you know, shooting all those unarmed people, you know. Finally, given the uh, reissuing of this film or the restored print, what do you want people to take away from it? What do you want to have people think about the meaning of Attica when they come to see this movie afresh? The meaning of Attica is that we have to be really, 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 really careful with our civil liberties because once you give people power over other people, all kinds of really crazy things can happen. And I, th I think we should take uh, Guantanamo really seriously. And I think we should take the fact that Bush wants to, you know, read everybody's emails and listen to everybody's phone conversations really seriously because you just can't take uh, freedom for granted. I mean, for, I remember when I was in, in Paris with the movie and all the, you know, the French journalists were saying, oh, it's so great that you could make this movie. We could never do it in, in France. And I'm like, really? And it, it never occurred to me. And so I think things could, could go south really quickly. And I think we have to really be scared of Bush and what Bush represents and that whole sort of drift, that gradual drift into uh, authoritarianism. Now, Cinder, when will the movie be shown? When will, uh, will its screenings be shown in Tribeca? Well, uh, um, there's only one more screening. It's uh, Saturday night at midnight. And um, after that, I'm looking for a distributor. And I'd like to really get it out uh, in movie theaters and on DVD. And so I'm looking to do that. Well, we're very happy to have Cinder Fires film, the director of Attica, with us today. Thank you so much for taking time to Thank speak to you. us. Thank you. And it functions you in a capacity as more or less like a vegetable because you're not able to think anymore because you're told what to do and when to do and how often to do it. I, mean, I don't think that any sane person can tolerate it. I don't care who you are. You're looking for humane treatment. That's all. Humane treatment. We are given a bath once a week, very briefly, once a week. You see? These things, you're taking away the bare necessities. Things that a man needs to feel like he's a human being. These are taken away. You don't have them. I don't know. I'm, I try not to be bitter, you see. Dealing with these people, trying to be bitter. But, I don't know, everything they do, everything they do is designed to destroy you. De dehumanize you, make you a complete nothing. So when I'm, God come in here, and he tell me to do something. Now, I'll do it. But now, at the same time, if I feel that he's wrong and I'm right, there's nothing that they can do to me. And this includes patting that last shovel of dirt in my face. They, they did everything but that. You understand? That's going to change my mind. And this is what I think the attitude of most of the inmates in there. For now, some time, we've all been concerned about this trouble that was brewing in the prison. It's, you could feel it in the air. Anybody that works in a prison or institution could feel things like that in the air. You know something is brewing. We're all apprehensive. But you can't tell when it's going to happen. Every night we expected it. I don't think nobody would intentionally try to provoke an incident because they know they realize that they don't have a chance. But at the same time, like you just can't keep presenting that garbage and accept somebody to take it. As we had a beautiful society in the yard, you know, because basically we realized, you know, that all we had was, was each other.